Hi guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be doing yet another BoxyCharm unboxing, this time for the month of October. If you don't know what BoxyCharm is, it's a monthly beauty subscription. You get four to five full-size items every single month for about $21, depending on where you live. So, without further ado, I will go ahead and get started. And, oh, this month, the theme is Spellbound. Cute little Halloween theme. By the way, I just want a little tip for you guys. These foam inserts that come in the BoxyCharm boxes are amazing for quick color changes with your brushes. I don't know if you'll be able to see how dirty this one is, but I use this one for my eyeshadow brushes. Um, so whenever I'm doing an eye look, and if I'm using a color that is bold or bright or vibrant or whatever, what have you, any color it could be, if you just kind of give it a rub on this foam, like it cleans the brush really, or it, it removes the color really well so that you're not, you know, mixing colors together and getting something muddy as opposed to true to color. So just so you know, these foam inserts are really good for quick color changes and you get them every month in your box anyways. So you don't have to go buy one of those quick change foam other things that you can buy. So hang on to these because they're really good for that. Just FYI. <laughs> okay, so I will be saving this one. Let's go ahead and grab this guy. This is the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed Highlighter. Retails for $38. The best selling creamy highlighter powder that will light up the features you love with a high shine finish. I have been wanting to try this highlighter for so long. So many of the YouTubers that I follow use one form or another of the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector either in the liquid or the powder and then the various shades. So I've really been wanting to try this because um, everyone that I've seen use it has loved it and it has looked amazing. So I'm super duper. And I'm excited that I got the powder actually. I mean, I, I would have loved the liquid as well, but I make super, I make super, I'm super excited to have gotten the pressed one. So this is how it looks. And I have the shade Prosecco Pop. So take off this little protective plastic. There it goes. And it is just this beautiful, I know you guys can't see it very well. But it's just this beautiful gold color. Oh goodness. Oh. Like I know the camera's far away, but do you see? I'm grabbing the Morphe MB43 brush. Okay. There it is. There's a mirror here, so I'll just go ahead and use it. Okay, I have no I have no highlighter. Oh, no highlighter on. That is a beautiful gold. Oh. And I love golden highlight. It's definitely not a subtle highlight, if you're more of a subtle highlight kind of girl. I don't think the camera is really picking up the amazingness of this highlighter, but trust me, it's pretty. Love it. So excited to finally have this. And it's so cool that in BoxyCharm you get full size items. Like, I mean, even if this had been a sample size or a deluxe sample size, I would have been happy. But I don't have to go buy that. This retails for $38. I paid $21 for this box. So, can you tell that I'm stoked? I'm super excited. But, anyways, that 
was the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Prosecco Pop. The next thing in my box that I'll grab is this guy. Why not? And I don't know how, how to pronounce this. Jean Tableau. This is a lip liner pencil in the shade Spice, 955 Spice. These retail for $5. Creamy, highly pigmented formula glides on effortlessly, can be used for flawless lip contouring worn alone or as a long lasting base for any lip color. So I will go ahead and put this on. Since there is another lip product in the box, I will use them together. And I'll probably just fill in the lips entirely so you guys can see the color well. It's frustrating sometimes because my upper lip is a little bit more pigmented than my bottom lip. And I don't like having foundation or powder or I don't like having product on my lips other than like lip products. I don't know, that's weird. But I don't have like having foundation or powder or anything on my lips. So of course I can't neutralize the natural pigmentation of my lips. So then whenever I do use lip products, the opacity is not always like on point because I didn't neutralize. But I do really like the color of this. Super pretty. Again, that's called spice. Okay, the next thing I'll grab then is this guy. And this I'm very excited to try also. I don't think I have any, I don't think I've ever tried any of these. This is the Tarte Tartist Quick Dry Matte Lip Paint. Retails for $20, a full coverage transfer proof liquid lipstick with a dry, a quick dry matte finish. I have the shade Bestie. And it's a little bit lighter than the pencil that I have on, so, but I think it'll be, I think it'll still work. Let's see. So this is the color here. I think it'll work nicely with this lip color, actually. It might, because and it might have, well, let's just do it, right? Okay. Well, it's got that divot in, the applicator, like the um, Jeffree Star Cosmetics and the Wet n Wild. I forgot this quick dry somebody, I shouldn't talk. I really do like the color. In person, it pulls a little a little warmer than what you can see probably on camera, but the color is very nice. I have a mirror over here, by the way, if you're like, what is she looking at? And then my monitor's over here. I'm just, I'm everywhere. So, but it's a, it's a little warmer in person, so it's not quite as washed out as it looks on the monitor there, so. But this is a very pretty color. I'm really excited to have this, especially with this slightly different or slightly darker colored lip liner. I like this a lot, actually. Okay, next thing in the box is this one. Dirty Little Secret. I've never used anything Dirty Little Secrets before either. And this is an eyeshadow chubby. Retails for 14. This creamy consistency allows you to use it alone as an eyeshadow or as an eyeshadow base. Looks like this is the shade Illusion, maybe, unless it's just a word on the box for some reason. Yes, Illusion. It does have a very nice consistency though, but obviously since my eyes are already done, I'm going to try putting this on in the inner corner and then on the brow bone maybe. It's a little bit like peachy, pinky to it, but
think it might be a little too light for me to use as a all over shape. I don't know, maybe it would work. But it's definitely very pretty. definitely try this as a base and I will try it as an all over the lid shade but I really do like this shade okay the last thing in the box today is this Dr. Brandt pore dermabrasion pore perfecting exfoliator retails for $58 this says pore perfecting technology at your fingertips with a professional grade micro crystal solution that instantly deep cleans and refines pores. Obviously, I will not be using this on camera for you guys. And I've never actually used Dr. Brandt products either. I got, I know I got a Dr. Brandt, I think it was like an age defying exfoliator in the past. So that was everything in my box. This month, the total value of the box was $135. Again, I paid $21, so to me, totally worth it, especially since everything in this box was something that I don't already have. So in my particular situation, it's an amazing deal. And again, they're full-size items. So I won't be using the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion on my face because I already have an amazing exfoliator. I will definitely be using the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector, of course, like I will use it all the time. The lip liner is great. The TARDIS matte lip paint is great. It's super matte. It does not transfer. Um, because it is a matte, it's a little bit drying, but it's actually not that bad. And for the state that my lips are actually in right now, I would say it's not bad at all, personally. So I will definitely continue to use this lipstick as well as the lip liner. I love this color, it's very pretty. But yeah, that will complete this video. I hope you enjoyed watching me try on these things for you and unboxing what came in my BoxyCharm. If you are subscribed to BoxyCharm, please let me know what you got down in the comments section down below. We don't all get the same exact things, so I would love to know what came in your box this month. Please do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to share with your friends and family and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, if you don't wanna miss any of my future uploads and you would like to be notified when I do upload, then also click on that bell button to turn on notifications. Wherever you are, I hope your day has been amazing. I hope the rest of your week is awesome and I really hope to see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.